it's Big Jack Films here. Uh, please forgive the crudeness of the setup. We're doing some major cleanups on the other side of the room where we normally do these reviews. Um, so you're pr all probably wondering what the hell this is. Well, um, this year is 2020, obviously, and God, we're all old as 90s kids are. But um, basically, this year marks the 20th anniversary of my all-time favorite television series, that being the anime series created by Rumiko Takahashi, Inuyasha. Uh, basically, the Lord of the Rings of anime, in my opinion. Um, I've grown up with this show. It was the show that I watched in most of my teenage years, and it really transitioned me from childhood stuff to adulthood stuff. It was the first time I saw a lot of mature, dark storylines. But overall, it's a great series and I've absolutely loved it and it's the 20th anniversary this year of the anime. Technically it's already 20 years old because the manga first started being published in Japan in 1996-97 which makes Kagome's timeline basically take place in 97. Um, but we'll get to that at some point. So um, to celebrate I will be essentially reviewing the entire show uh, every week as much as I possibly can. I'm gonna try to make a goal this year to review the entire s series. Now, basically these are gonna be kind of like uh, Doug Walker's uh, Last Airbender vlogs or his TV show vlogs where I talk about, you know, a certain set of episodes or an episode, you know, every vlog and kind of discuss my opinions and everything about it. But I'm gonna cheat it a little bit. What I'm actually gonna do is talk about every arc. So basically, every story arc that takes a few episodes to tell entirely, uh, that's going to be uh, one vlog. Now, I'm going to make the exception on filler episodes, because filler episodes, if they're just one episode, I'll probably just talk about them like as a basic thing. But in terms of story arcs, they're going to be mostly part one, part two, part three, and you know, like they're all going to be spread into essentially one video. So it's something I want to do. They're going to be essentially like this format, so it's a little bit easier for me to get out. Uh, and we're also going to be discussing the movies in between because I do like to go in chronological order and what's great is the movies are actually canon to the series. So I hope you guys enjoy these um, and what's going to be interesting about these is that they're going to be first exclusively on Patreon.com. If you guys want to help support the channel, uh, link down below to that. YouTube lately has been a little 50-50 with us and we do want to try to get funds for future projects as well as a maybe potential Inuyasha fan film at some point down the road. We're finally going to be maybe working on that, but in order to do so, we need the funds to produce it. So these uh, vlogs are going to be exclusive to Patreon, and maybe down the line, maybe like a month later or something, I will post them on YouTube eventually, but for now, these are going to be for Patreon. So if you guys want to see these vlogs, link down below, just a dollar or more, will get you early access to all these vlogs, as well as early content and other special features, and we hope you guys enjoy these. So, um, this is going to be a pretty fun adventure to kind of look back on the entire series. I mean, for me, this is my version of reading Lord of the Rings once a year. I try to watch the entire show once a year, as long with other things, you know, I have my favorite share of um, my favorite TV shows, you know, home movies being probably second best, Dragon Ball, Sailor Moon, and so on, but these are something I want to actually do, um, especially around when we get to Anime North, there's gonna be some fun, maybe some vlogs there, but I have plans for this, so uh, tune in uh, next week when we take a look at the first arc in the series that Mostly is the origins of the Sacred Jewel, but I'm going to be calling it the Yura and the Sacred Jewel arc because it introduces the Sacred Jewel and our first villain of the series. So um, until then, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this introduction and tune in next week as we take a look at the entire series of Inuyasha. Take it easy.